Hi, my name is Logan with Heirloom Builders. We're a custom home builder in the Piedmont of North Carolina. You know, building a custom home is a 20 to 30 year financial commitment. And most of the time it takes nine to 12 months to build. The process is full of options and considerations and it can be super stressful if it doesn't go smoothly. So many people decide they wanna build a custom home and they don't know where to start. They don't know anything about the process. Where do I site the house? How much money should I budget for this house? It's hard then to know what questions to even ask your contractor. We're here to help you understand the big picture so that you can effectively make good decisions and help steer your project on the right path. Our goal is to demystify custom home building. We want you to understand the big picture so that you can make effective decisions for your project along the way. We'll show you the basic components of a house and how those systems function together so that you can make effective decisions along the whole project. This is the outdoor unit. You can barely hear it. It is so quiet. The way that it works is that it's a variable speed heat pump. It runs at a lower speed for longer so that it moves more air, thereby reducing the indoor air humidity and reducing any mold and mildew issues that you might have in the house and can actually create a more healthy indoor air quality. Building a custom home is hard work. It takes a lot of experience, a lot of planning, time, and money. So what do you do if you want to build a custom home and you don't know where to start? Or what if you know how to build a home and you want to build it green? That's why we created this channel, to demystify the custom home building process. We think of sustainability by design. Many of the things that we're gonna show you don't cost any extra money. It's just a matter about putting the right materials in the right place at the right time. We're gonna be talking about the most cost-effective insulation strategies. So we get structural strength of the plywood and the insulation value of one inch of foam that adds R5 to every bit of this house. Foundation considerations like radiant heat. And framing assemblies like two by six stud framing. Versus straw bale construction. Versus hemp creek construction. And roofing systems that can help you collect and filter rainwater. We are super excited to show you how to build green and to push the green building movement to the next level. So don't forget to like and subscribe.